Hey fellow foodies, it's Faye from facefood.com. Today I'm going to show you how to make creme anglaise, which is just a fancy French way of saying basically a vanilla cream sauce. It's a great thing to have in your toolkit because it goes well with many, many different things. So I'm going to be scaling this recipe out in the video, but I know many of you don't have a scale or refuse to use one. So in the blog, the recipe will actually be just in regular cup measurements, okay? So we're going to start out with the cream and some of the milk and some of the sugar. And we're gonna just combine that in a saucepan. And then the next part is we're going to separate our whites from our yolks and then set that aside. For this recipe, we'll just need the yolks. And then we're gonna combine some sugar as well with the yolks. And just FYI, in the pictures on the blog and in this video, this recipe is actually halved because I didn't need that much. But the uh, full recipe will be on the blog. Right, and then you want to combine this for about 30 seconds. Um, I whisk it for about 30 seconds. That's all that's really required. But if you wanted kind of a paler sauce, um, you can whip it for about 5 minutes. It'll get lighter in color. Okay, so our saucepan we have over a medium heat. I'm gonna just whisk this for a little bit just to get it started. And then we'll leave it. And then our attention's back on the egg yolks. And uh, what we are doing now, we're adding some milk that we set aside. So this is just some regular room temperature milk we set aside in the beginning. And then you just wanna whisk that in. And now our attention's back on the uh, cream milk mixture. And this is on a, a medium heat. We want it to uh, be stirred every now and then and we wanna really just bring it to a boil. Okay, and once you get to the point where it reached that boil, you can take it off the heat. And then we're gonna slowly add it in to the egg yolk mixture while whisking. This is of course called tempering. So you wanna go slow, you wanna keep whisking while you're doing this. And then once you add all that in, you're gonna add that mixture back to the saucepan and we're gonna get it back on the heat. Okay, so if you're using a vanilla bean, you would uh, add it to the beginning when we first started with the cream and the milk. If you're adding vanilla extract or vanilla bean paste, I would add it at this point. Okay, so I do switch to a rubber spatula, kind of midway through the process. And what we're looking to do here is just cook it over a low heat until it thickens up. It should reach 165 to 185 degrees Fahrenheit. Or you could do that finger test where you run your finger down the middle of the spatula and if the uh, sauce stays apart, you're good to go. So you want this nice and thick and creamy. You don't want it runny. You don't want it grainy. Once you reach the consistency you like, you can go ahead and strain it into a nice clean bowl that is placed over some ice. Uh, you can make an ice bath whatever you choose. Okay, so we're just straining it to get any gunk we don't want in there. All right, and then what you would do is just cover it, refrigerate it, and it keeps for up to two days. So for the full recipe, go to facefood.com and like this video, subscribe to this channel for more great videos on the way. Comment below with any comments or questions, I'd really appreciate it. And I really appreciate the support. And until next time, guys, you guys have a wonderful day.